Okay, what I do with Millie now is I have a spray bottle with the shampoo in it and I spray it all over her, all over her back, all over her head, everywhere that you would usually do. Scrub it up, make it nice and foamy and then I get my coat king. Okay, Millie is nice and soapy. Um, I've got my Coke King here, it's a 20. Millie, don't need it. Um, sorry, it's not focusing very well. Um, it's got a whole heap of rubber bands, just twisted around it. Any which way, Millie, stop. Um, so what we do is yeah, she really should be standing up. Yummy, good girl. All right. Get the coat king. All right. What you want to do is pull it down with the with the uh, hair growth, the way the hair is growing. Okay, so that means on these sides, down like this. Um, I'm holding the camera, but if I wasn't, I really should be holding her skin taut. You know, like up like that so that I'm not pulling her skin. Um, see how I just moved around everywhere? I never start at the same place. Because um, if you start at the same place, you start to get um, like track lines. Like if you're starting here and pulling back, you're gonna keep getting a line there. Um, just that little bit there, you can see how much hair's coming out. Um, I just have a tub next to me where I chuck the hair. Um, yeah, I mean, it's not hard. If she was a show dog, I'd be doing this a bit differently. Um, for example, she would have already been hand stripped, so there wouldn't be as much fluff. Um, some do use Coke Kings, um, but I'm less picky about it. So you can see now and then I get, oh, sorry, I get the occasional... Actually, that one's pretty good, but I get occasionally a guard hair, which you'll see is not fluff. You can see, see the bits of fluff. You occasionally get a straight hair, and that's just because um, you've gone the wrong way with the hair, or you're not holding it properly, which would be because I'm not holding her skin tight. Um, you want to do... Let me snap. You want to do all of her back... Um, if you can, do down the front on their legs and on here. Um, neck, don't touch the ears, I don't touch the ears. I occasionally thin these out a bit if they're getting a bit thick and woolly. Um, don't touch her legs. I do hear a little bit if it's getting thick and woolly, but you want to come down and follow the leg around till the hook, so it's all about there, with the coat king. Um, you can do the tail if you want, I don't. But she's got a nice silky tail. Um, head. There's a couple of ways to do head. You can see there's um, quite a lot of fluff going on there at the moment. But even with the coking, we'll have it the right way. I'm not getting much out. Um, and that's because her hair is really stuck in at the top, which is why I use a couple of different other tools or I just get the thinning scissors or the clippers if I'm really annoyed. Um, yeah, that's about it. Um, I will record myself doing it, but um, obviously won't have any sound. Um, then basically I wash out all the shampoo. My conditioner, well actually I've got conditioner in at the moment and then I shampoo but that's just because I'm using um, a particular shampoo and conditioner that asks you to condition first. Um, but yeah, so I wash out the shampoo and conditioner um, and then dry her off and then you'll see again on Coat King when she's dried off.
Emily has had her bath. She's had her coking done. She's also been blow dried. Um, we're going to go over again with the coking, but you can already see massive difference from the before pictures. Um, <laughs> curly whirly head, but um, back is a lot smoother. It's a nicer colour. Um, she's a bit of a funny light on the grooming table. I'll see if I can get a stand up for you. Just some bribery. There we go. So you can see, much nicer if the camera will focus. There we go. Alright, just to show you again with the coking, I'm a little bit here in it still at the moment, but um, running it through her, you can see basically nothing coming out. Um, you just want to keep keep doing it until absolutely nothing comes out. So like you can still see little tiny fluffy bits, um, which I, if I was um, really going to go extreme grooming her, I would end up getting a plastic glove on and pulling them all out. Uh, but I'm quite happy with that, quite happy with the way that it's finished. Um, the, her front legs are fluffy because I can never get that out, so I end up just clipping it um, or getting thinning scissors and thinning it all. Um, her rear leg, I try to shape it in with the uh, coat king, so I pull it out from where it needs to come out, um, which is along this line. <laughs> As you can see, she's getting pretty tired with getting getting groomed, aren't you, darling? So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to leave it there. Hopefully, this video works. And um, Millie says thank you for watching. Teacher, good girl. <laughs>